Hi there, I'm Jessica from UPDF and today I'm going to show you how you can organize your PDF documents using UPDF. Using this feature, you can organize your documents in any way you want to help fit your needs. But before we dig deep into how to organize your pages in your PDF, please download UPDF using the link in the description box below. You can use these PDF organization features on any of your devices, including Mac, Windows, Android and iOS devices. In this video, we are only going to talk about how to organize your pages using Windows or Mac. So first of all, let's start the discussion by discussing the Insert Pages feature. UPDF provides its users the chance to insert pages anywhere into your PDF file with just a single click of a button. Now, let's analyze how to insert pages into your PDF document using UPDF. Upon opening the UPDF application, select the file that you would like to insert pages to. Then select Organize Pages from the left toolbar and select Insert, which will give you a drop-down menu of options of what you can insert into your document. Here we are inserting a blank page, but you can also insert pages from a PDF file that you already have saved. To do this, select the PDF that you would like to open and it allows you to choose which page or pages that you would like to insert directly into your document. Once you have added your new pages to your document, you can drag and drop them to change the order of the appearance of the pages in your PDF. In addition to organizing pages, UPDF also gives users the opportunity to extract pages as separate documents to optimize your document management. Doing so will help you to separate pages with important information from lengthy PDFs to make content consumption a lot easier for readers. Now, let's see the steps for extracting pages from your PDF to enhance your PDF navigation. Select the pages for extraction either by clicking on the Selection Pages button or by manually selecting your pages. Once you have chosen the desired pages, click on Extract, which will then allow you to extract these pages into a new document on their own. UPDF also gives you the option to divide lengthy documents into shorter ones with the split feature. Using this feature, users get the chance to split PDF documents by number, dividing each file by the number of pages that are selected. In the Organize Pages tab, select the Split button to give you options on how to split your document. In this case, we're going to split by number of pages, which is where you choose the number of pages that you would like to have for each document. And then it will create the correct number of documents based on the number of pages you have chosen. While using the PDF Organizer feature in UPDF, you can get the opportunity to change the orientation and dimensions of the files. For this purpose, users can utilize the Rotate or the Crop Pages feature. Through this part of the video, we're going to show you how you can use these functionalities on UPDF. First of all, let's start out with the rotation task. First of all, head to the Organize Pages tab to see an overview of all of your pages. Then select the pages that you would like to rotate, and then simply select either the Rotate Counterclockwise or the Rotate Clockwise icon to rotate all of the pages at the same time. Now, I'm going to show you the two different functionalities in the Crop Pages feature. The first method to crop out pages is the Crop Pages feature, which allows you to change the dimension of your pages. Take guidance from the steps ahead to set the desired dimensions of your PDF pages. For the first option, head to the Crop Pages icon in the left side toolbar. From here, head to the toolbar on the right hand side where you can change the properties for cropping your page. For example, you can change the width and the height of your cropping page selection. You can also manually drag the cropping box if you want to change the size of the cropping area. In addition, you can click Constrain Properties, which will allow you to maintain a fixed ratio between the height and width of your pages. Once you have finished applying your dimensions, select Crop at the bottom and it will crop your page based on your selection. UPDF also provides the option to split pages to crop out specific information with this feature. With the help of this feature, you can crop the pages horizontally or vertically to crop out any information you don't want. To do this, follow the steps in the video that are coming up now. First of all, select the Crop Pages icon and then select Split to choose your features of how you want to split the pages. Choosing the Equal Division option allows you to add a value to determine the number of page splits you want to apply. For example, if you want to divide the page into four equal sections, you need to write three to add three splitting lines. Next, choose the left to right option from the default reading direction when your file is in English. 
Afterwards, enable the Apply Changes option and select your desired page range to which you want to apply this page splitting effect. Finally, turn on the Delete Original Page After Splitting option if you don't want to keep the original page in the document. Once you have chosen all of the settings, press the Split button at the bottom to crop out your different sections as a separate page. After watching this video, you are now an expert on how to organize your pages using the organization feature in UPDF. If you still have issues regarding any of the organization features in UPDF and you would like some of our help or advice, please leave us a comment in the comment section below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like this video to see more tutorials in the future on how to use UPDF. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video.